What is up guys, this is Smith262 and I am back with another video for you guys. This time it's on the lovely Call of Duty 4 and I'm on the map overgrown like you all know. And this video right here is being submitted to Northern L Studios Commentary Contest. The winner of the commentary get contest gets a HD PBR, which would be great because I have a Dazzle Platinum. And if you guys didn't know, um, I'm a Machinima Respawn Director and a Machinima Sports Director. So it would be great to have an HD PVR because if you guys didn't know, if I have a da I have a Dazzle Platinum, and once you submit send your video into Machinima Respawn, you have to put it under their settings, and then once they get it, they have to re-render it and put their watermark on the video. So it it has to be re-rendered again, and the quality isn't the best. That's why, if you guys haven't seen my videos, you may see some comments saying. Why, why isn't it great call quality? Because, you know, once it gets to Machinima, the quality quality gets lowered down, and since it's on YouTube as well, the quality isn't the best. So it would be great if I could win, um, get my channel more known, so, you know, I would have HD, HD quality with an HD PVR. And if I would win this commentary contest, I would make a contest of my own trying to give away the Dazzle. Platinum. If anyone wanted it, I would do a contest as well, like Northern L Studios is doing, and I would just give it away to the the best gameplay and the best commentary. And so, as you guys can see in the title, it says "You Done Goof." I've been watching this video right now for like two weeks long. <laughs> this video has been out for two weeks, and if you guys haven't seen this video yet, you have to go see it. It's a must watch. If you guys haven't seen the video, you guys must have been living under a rock for like the last two weeks or whatever. It's about this person who got made a YouTube video because she got hated on and I always watch this video when I need to laugh and she, she cries in the video and her dad comes in the room like he's Billy Mays which is really funny <laughs> and I'm, I have a, a, an audio clip for you guys so you guys can hear it so so here you go and you guys have ruined my life I'm gonna tell you right now dad. this is from her father you bunch of lying no good punks and I know who it's coming from because I've backtraced it and I know who's emailing and who's doing it. And you've been reported to the cyber police and the state police. Right. So you one better one. write one more thing or screw with my computer again. You'll be arrested. You End of conversation from her father. You write a fucking yeah. gonna come and beat her ass. And if you come near my daughter, guess what? Consequences will never be the same. You lying bunch of pricks! And who said you're gonna beat my daughter up? You will have to deal with the police. Cause you done goofed. Cause you done goofed. Cause you done goofed. I don't know about you guys, but I think that video is hilarious. Every time I watch the video or even hear the audio, audio of the video, I always laugh. This here, the guy saying, you done goofed. Like, who actually thinks of that? You done goofed. Back traced it. Cyber police, like this guy should be a comedian because I, I always laugh when I see that video. So whenever I need a, I need a laugh in the day, bam, I turn on that video and, and I'm always laughing. Even even on Machinima Respawn, you know, with Mr. Sark, Hutch, Scene Anders, you know, the, the popular guys. <laughs> even Scene Anders referenced it even in one of his videos. He's like, you done goof. So Scene Anders meant referencing it most likely. You know, it's pretty well known, and I'm pretty sure you guys all seen that because it hit a million views in like two days. So it's a very popular video, and they removed they removed a very popular one with like two million views the other day because you know <laughs> they removed it. But there's always going to be uploads of that video because it's so it's so hilarious what ha what happened. And he, the, that video made it so big they were even covered covering it on the news. You can look it up on the on YouTube and type in news with that you done goofed. And the people are on the news talking about it and everything like that. And there's been t tons of videos talking about, you know, the You Done Goof story. But they don't really mention the the real stuff. And what I mean by the real stuff is what happened. The, per the girl's YouTube account got hacked. Got hacked. And also, they found out her address, her number, every single, everything. And the people called, called pizza stores, called all these things, and started just placing orders to her house. So she was getting pizza deliveries like every every hour, which is pretty jokes, and they were order, ordering UPS boxes. 
So she was getting, you know, flamed and everything like that, and her parents were pissed off. In this video, in this clip right here, this is a clip that you want to break your PS3 controller or 360 controller. Look at this. The knife is inside of him. The knife's inside of him. And look what happened. I died. This is why I don't really like knifing, and I hate knifing, and I hate getting knifed, because look at this bullshit. I can never knife anyone. I'm like, worst sniper in the world. That's just evidence right there. The knife is inside the guy, and I, and I lose. Which makes absolutely no sense. So yeah, that you done goof video is pretty jokes. If you haven't go seen it, go watch it. I guarantee you guys will have a laugh of the, of the dad walking in the room like Billy Mays, pointing the finger, which is pretty funny. So yeah, let me talk about this gameplay really quickly right now. I'm using the P90 with the silencer, of course. Frag three, stopping power, extreme conditioning, my usual setup, and I dropped 84 kills in this game, which is a pretty good game on Overgrown for a domination, and. What you guys want to do, I'll give you guys a little tip. You guys always want to keep an eye on that UAV. Always keep an eye on the UAV. It's called the 4 Modern Warfare 2. Because there's always people that aren't wearing, si aren't using silencers on their guns. I haven't, I don't think I've ever been in a game where the whole team was using a silencer. I don't think it ever happened. In Call of Duty 4, it's, it's way easier because you automatically have a UAV. So I'm going to get three kills in a row quickly. That's why in this game I must have got tons of UAVs in this game. So I always know where they are. And even if I don't have a UAV, always check the radar. Because every time I play, every five to seven, ten seconds, I look up top left of my screen and look at where the people are so I can try and flank. That's why most of my gameplays, you guys see, I always flank. And flanking is the best thing when you're rushing. Because it catches them off guard and bam, you can just get a lot of kills by it. And like you guys probably probably do know, in Call of Duty 4, it doesn't work for Modern Warfare 2. Try, if you get a helicopter, don't use it right away. You've seen me do this a couple times, I think, in this video, where I didn't call in the helicopter right away. I waited till I died, and then I would call it in. Because if you do that in Call of Duty 4, if you do that in Call of Duty 4, then that helicopter counts to your next kill streak, which is a which is beastly. Because you may not have to do any work. You can like chill back like some people do with the Harrier in Modern Warfare 2 and let the Harrier do work and you know it's gonna give you kills. But in this game, the helicopter will increase your kill streak. So if you guys still play Call of Duty 4, I suggest doing this. And I'm pretty sure all you guys know, but I never knew this in the beginning. I was I never knew this. I found out this like what's it called? A year ago. But this game has been out for like three years now, I think. Yeah, three years I think. So it's a pretty pretty long time and this game is really fun to play. If you guys are getting mad at Modern Warfare 2, I, I suggest, you know, switching to Mon Call of Duty 4, and you're going to have fun playing this. And what I've seen recently on Twitter for 402, they said they're, they should be working, working on a patch to fix one-man army, and it should be available soon, so they better, better, you know, fix that up. Because, <laughs> you know, one-man one army pisses everyone off in the YouTube community and everyone in the gaming community. No one likes new tubes. And... <laughs> You know, everyone gets frustrated, and that's what people get mad and, you know, break their controllers. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This has been my gameplay for the commentary contest. So, can you guys please give it a thumbs up? A thumbs up for an 84 kill game and 7 deaths. And if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel, come subscribe. And I will see you guys later, and look out for more of my videos on Machinima Respawn. So, see you later.